Stars TV. Sweet. So in the game of Guilty Gear, um, as far as UK f um, is involved, who for you personally is the guy to beat? And also, who do you think in Europe is the guy to beat? Uh, well, in the UK... <sighs> I'll, I'll, <laughs> I want to say I'm, I'm the best. Whee! I, I want to say that. And I'm going to say that. But there are two people that kind of make me doubt it sometimes. One is Sean. Uh, Sean English. Shout out to Awesome Sauce. Uh, he plays Venom. Uh, I beat him a versus fighting. I popped off because I was happy because I, I, he, he is a really good player. And Kyzertron, uh, he plays Bedman. Uh, obviously, you might think, well, he beat you in finals, so he, I must think he's better than me. He doesn't practice that much. He is a very sick player, but I think now I'm better than him, which by default makes me the best. <laughs> uh, saying that, I think. A lot of it is down to people not knowing the matchup, uh, being scared of Leo, thinking they can't do stuff, and that's why I put out tech videos because I don't want to win on the merit that people don't know how to fight my character. So I'll happily tell people how to beat my character. Hence why the tech videos aren't just for Leo players, it's for people learning how to beat Leo. But I'll tell you my gaps and stuff that isn't real, stuff to look out for. So, uh, but yeah, I think I'm the best. Pretty much. <laughs> like I'll, I'll happily money match anyone and deal with it. And Europe. In Europe, uh, it's a bit harder for me to say. There is a lot of lot of online sleepers that people just don't know about because they don't enter tournaments. Yeah. Uh, I think the main one is probably Halloween. Uh, his elf is wrecking people left, right, and center. I played him a couple of times online. I got brushed up. Uh, I, I think now if I played him, it will be a bit closer. I still think he's better than me, uh, but I think the Leo factor could kick in and. I could, I could nick a couple of wins. If it's a tournament setting and it's two out of three, like with Leo, anyone can win. So that's, that's my mindset on that. Uh, and obviously, there's a couple of other people from like Europe, but uh, yeah, he's my main focus now because I believe he's going to be at Revo. So I want to get as much uh, LFL practice as I can. Cool beans. Um, so you're a bit of a fiend for money matches. Um, no, notably, you had one with uh, you and Makai recently. Uh, it was quite, quite funny because you don't play Street Fighter 4, but you took him down. Um, if anyone else wants to money match you, is there any Instagram or um, sorry, yeah. not Instagram, social medias uh, pages that they can contact you through if they want to money match you, or just get in contact with you in general? Yeah, uh, yeah, I don't want people just tweeting me about money matches, but uh, <laughs> yeah, uh, Twitter is mop uh, underscore c 4 iq uh, I'm on there quite a bit. Uh, you could contact me straight through uh, YouTube. Uh, the YouTube is called Mash on Pad. Uh, I'm on it mostly, so if you leave a comment in there, I'll probably see it. Uh, and the Facebook group, uh, we've got a Mash on Pad one, and we've also got a Situation Damage one. Uh, if you go on the Situation Damage one, you'll know where I am if you want to come match, money match me in something. Uh, that's where I'll be, and obviously, yeah, if you join that group, you'll come to our session for half price. So that's always a bonus as well. On Sunday situational damage. Sunday situational damage, yeah, yeah at a hook. So, so usually it's a tenner and you can come in for a fiver if you get involved with situational damage. Yes. Then um, the fiver you save, you can use the money match me. <laughs> Only in GG or Skullgirls. <laughs> I don't want to do another one in Street Fighter 4 because that's that is definitely not my game anymore. Okay. Street Fighter 5, come see me. <laughs> okay guys, this was uh, MOP C4IQ and this is LOM MOP Lockbox Q.